Hey there, this is the Market Doll Queen coming at you from MD Live. This is December 11th, 2020, and I have a link right here for you to come visit our Discord. We're pretty much having an open house till the end of the year, and we are having a sign-up special. Please come into our Discord, come visit our trading community, and see what a difference a fun place of like-minded individuals makes in your trading game. Right now, I'm looking at a naked chart, and I'm looking at Jemiah. I'm going to call it Jemiah, J-M-I-A. And this has made my option alert list many times in the past few weeks, if not the past few months. And I'm looking at a naked chart right now, and I'd like to show you how to add some simple indicators to help you stay in the trade longer and make better gains. So we're going to go right up here. You can add studies many different ways. You can use any of these chemistry beakers right here and right here, or you could do it right here on this far right-hand little box. Go right here to studies. Go to add a study. We're going to go to upper studies. And then up to A through D, let's go ahead and add Bollinger Bands. I find Bollinger Bands very simple and very easy to read. New traders, I highly recommend that if you're just going to start out with some simple indicators, let it be the Bollinger Bands. They've already been worked out. Each of these outer bands are two standard deviations away from the, the median price, up above and down below. I like my Bollinger Bands and um, any other indicators that are in a group together to have the same like colors. So go ahead and right click on the Bollinger Band. Let's edit the study and let's go ahead and change the lower band to this color and the upper band to the same color. Hit apply. And then for the midline, I like it to be dotted just so it stands out differently. It could go ahead and stay blue. That's fine. That's fine with me. Hit apply. Hit OK. And there you go. There is the basic Bollinger Bands. And you can see it makes much better sense when the outer bands are identical in color, okay? To help you understand how to use Bollinger Bands, when they expand, the, the momentum and the volume has increased. When they contract, that's when the share price starts to go choppy. So there you go. There's your simple Bollinger Bands added to your, your chart right there. You can use this on any chart that you would like. You can go to anything. I usually use a five-day, five-minute graph. And there you go. I hope this helps you get started with just the baby steps of an indicator. Remember, we are having a special right now. Come on in. To our MD Live. Um, we're waiting to meet you. Make sure you get this link right here and come see us. We'll see you there.